Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Folktale. And on this episode, we are going to be continuing where we left off. Now, for those of you who may have missed the last episode, we have gotten quite a bit of stuff done. Unfortunately, we did kind of make a lapse in uh, in memory or judgment there, and we forgot to put down the herbalist in. So we got a lot of people who are sick and, and getting sicker by the minute, and so we need to get this going here. And if you click on it, you'll see that they are trying to make stuff as fast as possible. Unlocks elixir crafting recipes not implemented yet, and herbalist production of lesser medicine potion by one. Definitely need that going on. I would even upgrade this to tier three if I could, just to get as much uh, of that production as possible. Now you can see herbs are used to mix a base uh, used in all potion making, and we have zero of that. And then they use the herbs to make the lesser potions, which we also have zero of. This thing is maxed out with people, but they are all level one because they just got the job. And, uh, you know, I'm trying to do as much as I possibly can in the amount of time that we have, but it uh, I hope it's not too late because our guys are getting sick. Now everything else is pretty much maxed out, uh, the, you know, research as well as their levels other than a few things here and there like they do need to go up to tier three these are all mostly tier two because we've been kind of worried or not worried but waiting on our iron to kind of get there and the iron is just taking a little while we did make a, a lapse in judgment there as well and forget to put a warehouse close by so that they can deliver that iron and get the resources they need the food and water and things of that sort uh, you know in a timely manner so we did kind of correct that and put another one down a little closer by and I'm just checking to make sure that there's there's nothing here that can be uh, upgraded to, um, on their stuff brewing master 2000 yeah let's go ahead and do that it's expensive but I think it's gonna be worth it this one nothing left there we don't really need the woodcutter but we'll, we'll check it anyways and down here I believe this is all yeah this has all been maxed out for a while now and you probably maxed out yeah you're pretty maxed out weaver I think we started with that yeah so we're back at square one over here all right, so this one, we just gotta have to wait. Let's go with elixirs. It's not implemented yet, but I'm gonna put it in there anyways. How much do we got? We got 130 of the herbs, and let's see, what about medicine? This building has 20, 19, all buildings 22. Okay, so they're delivering it. They're definitely delivering it. They only have to go to this little spot right here to deliver it. So they don't have to go that far, which is nice. It's definitely, uh, you know, very, very close by, and I think that's gonna help our guys kind of recover from this this uh, like I said lapse of judgment and keeping an eye on what's going on now I'm already back at two uh, wow look at that it looks beautiful at night here guys I like the look of that that's actually really really cool oh you can hear the bees oh, listen to that guys you can hear like the chanting now, let's turn to chapter 15. <laughs> That's cool. I don't think I've ever zoomed in that that uh, close. Let's see. Let's watch these guys go to work. Hi ho! No, no, no. We can't sing that one. It's copyrighted, guys. Uh, let's see what's going on. I, you know, I mean, if I was going out into the field and I was gonna be mining, I might take a pack like that. But if I was gonna go right next door, I don't think I would take all that heavy stuff with me. That that looks really, really uncomfortable. That's uh, no wonder they go as slow as they go. So let's go ahead and upgrade that. Get, uh, get that going for them. Give them a little bit of boost here and see what we can give them. No more research, huh? This building cannot be upgraded anymore, but thankfully we can put more people inside of it. So let's this do that. Already supports the maximum <laughs> number of specialists. So we'll have 12 people going up there. Remember those four people who are going to be joining them are not professionals. We lost some people over here in the oh Woodcutter's boy. Lodge. So let's put some people back there. I'm guessing they died from uh, from the that noxious poison that they had there. Eight out of twelve. What about over here? Eight out of eight. Seven out of eight. Let's do one okay. more. What about you, bakery? Everybody's good. Butcher is still at three. That's good. I, he doesn't really need to be any higher than that until I have a nice supply of meat, and it's still at six. So yeah, that's that's not a nice supply of meat. How about my my beer just is not going up. I don't care what I do to it. It just will not go up anymore. I have eight people at the tavern. I have uh, eight people over here. Let me look in here. How much How much honeycomb do we got? We got 30 still. And we got all buildings, barrels of mead, 2,000. So I should have more than this. I should have more than 400, 500 in there if I got 2,000 barrels. And I got tons of these bee yards all at 100%. 
Unless it's this. Unless this just has to be the one that gets upgraded. So I might try that. I might try upgrading this one a little bit more in the future. But it's going to take me a little while before I get 250 stone. Or iron, I should say. Stone is, is fine. Although, to be honest, now that uh, the iron is producing as fast as it is, I might have a problem with stone in the future. Or wood. Wood, wood doesn't uh, come in as fast as I might like as well. Because they pretty much chopped everything down. Now, as soon as we get all of these buildings to tier 3 and I have everything that I possibly want I'm gonna build me an army and once I get the army we're gonna go into that cave you may be like oh that's kind of overkill right wait till you get to that point well to be honest guys uh, you know I, I went in there a little early last time and when I came out I wasn't ready to go off exploring just yet and this time when I come out I want to make sure I'm ready for it so that's why I'm kind of waiting on that one and just uh, you know doing it uh, this way I'm doing it a little slower than you guys may like but Hopefully when we come back out, we're just going to be able to just, you know, punch right through that stuff and, and just go off it. Because there was a choice last time. Which way do you want to go? Do you want to talk to one side or the other side? And I didn't really get to experiment with that. I didn't really get to go off and, and decide which side I wanted to join. Because, uh, you know, my city was falling apart and I wasn't able to, to kind of concentrate. So, yeah, I, I don't want to have that happen. Let's see, cotton fields, they're all doing pretty well, 100%. I guess as long as you have a couple cotton fields or any fields at 100%, it means your workers are not getting to them fast enough, which means you have enough fields. For me, though, I can't get ca or carrots for the life of me to ever survive. They they get them and then they eat them like nearly immediately. So I would consider it a very small victory or a very large victory, actually, if I can get carrots to grow on a large scale where I can actually keep a whole bunch. Wow, these guys look really, really pale. At least one of them did. Yeah, that guy looks really pale. For somebody who works out on the farm, that guy is way, way too pale. Look at that, guys. That is that is nuts. Actually, I can't seem to get a good... Let's wait until he comes around the corner. There he is. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think you can work out on the farm and be that pale, guys. Not a thing. Not going to be happening. How are you guys doing over here? Really well, actually. Really well. Holy crap. We got 177 already. All right. You know what we're going to do? We're gonna take my guy off and we're gonna go off and explore a little bit there's some Quick enemies march. there's de there's definitely some enemies over here that we can kind of get a little bit of experience on and if we get into trouble we'll just run back to the tower because that's uh that should help us out a little bit now i hope this doesn't ruin it for us and i don't get in over my head and bring back you know a gazillion guys but uh, if it does uh you know that's that's just gonna be the way it works i guess can we grab that what is that Thistles. Well, I'll go ahead and grab it. I don't know what it does, but you could definitely use a little bit of it, I think. Come on, Come get in there. Come to daddy. Let's do uh, iron skin. That way we don't take any damage, or really uh, very much damage at all. And then we're going to use decisive... Uh, no, we'll use uh, shill bash, and then we'll use decisive victory. There we go, and you are dead, punk. Nice. Oh, what do we got? Tower shield, usable by Sir Gregory. And five gold. All right, let's zoom in a little bit. And we'll go into uh, his inventory here. Where is it at? Right there. And we'll go into my inventory. I do kind of wish it would, like, pop up with his inventory already. 24 physical, 22... Uh, so it's not even as good as what he has on. Huh. That, that's, you know, that kind of sucks. So let's, uh, let's get rid of that. Let's go ahead and salvage that since he's not going to be able to use it. What about this? Leather pauldrons, uh, Sir Gregory, 8 physical damage... Can he use that? Yes, he can. 10 physical armor. Said Gregory, plus 4 physical resistance. So let's put that on, because that's going to be better. And we'll go ahead and get rid of... Actually, no, we'll save that, because that's for the City Watch as well. Woodcutters as well, so a lot of people can use that one. So that's kind of nice. What about a belt? He doesn't have a belt on yet. 3 physical, so we'll go ahead and put that on. And gloves, City Watch. Hmm... We'll put these ding down here then, so when we finally get some more City Watch guys, uh, he should be good to go. Ready for Let's duty. go ahead and get in. Now that my guy has recharged both his power and his life, we're going to see which ones come down to meet him. Hopefully not all four. And I guess if they're not going to come down to meet him, he's going to go up to meet them. Oh, this is going to end badly. This is going to end badly, guys. We're going to have to run it. Come on, run it. Let's, let's do it down here where there's a choke point. Hopefully this works, uh, or you can you can just turn your back to him, apparently. Um, yeah. Let's do Power Slam. Area effect. Let's, let's move it back. Move it back. 
Oh man, let's let's bring it back over here to the uh, the tower. We we need some some assistance, guys. Stop attacking that stupid spider. Get him over here. Today, All right. You How are we gonna do this? Horribly. Oh yeah, that this is not gonna work. It's, he's he's just too many, too many. Look at his life go down so fast, guys. Power slam. All right, run it, run it. You, you gotta run around in circles, guys. Run around in circles. Oh no, they're coming. Forward. They're coming. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, no, this is gonna end so badly. Decisive victory? Nope, not enough, but enough to do some damage to him. We should be able to kill at least one if we uh, if we don't suck here. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on, just a little bit more. Ah, oh, come on. Get in there. There we go. Whew. All right, what are these other guys doing? I don't care as long as they stay right there. That, that's good for my guy. Let, let his life go back up, and then he'll go back over there and try to... Why'd you have to bring him over here? Literally, you, you, you brought him. Ah, oh, crap. All right. All right, let's do shield bash. Stun him for a second. We don't have enough for decisive victory. Hopefully, our power will go back up. There we go. Decisive victory. Almost. Almost. And one hit. Whew. All right. Sir Gregory. Sir Gregory, you got a nice little workout right there. You almost died, but you survived. Spear uncommon, 13. Doesn't say who can use that one, though. All right, sir. Sir, you are going to take a break. You're going to you're gonna rest for a little while. Because we do have a little bit more uh, a little bit more stone now. And that's fully upgraded, right? Yeah, that's fully upgraded. So let's do one more of these buildings. Get some more people in here. And that's probably going to be it until they show up. We're going to put some more people in some of these. I'm thinking uh, the tavern needs to go first. The tavern really needs these people. 250. Don't have it yet. Wow, I got a lot of freaking money, guys. Let's, let's buy some stuff. Let's go in here and... Uh, we can upgrade this. Why didn't we upgrade this earlier? Yeah. Okay. Well, it's not going to do anything good for us, I don't think. But let's. New settlers have arrived. Let's do iron stone block. Where is the iron? Iron ign. Okay, there we go. Two fifty. We'll do. There we go. That should be good. Gives us a nice chunk of iron settlers there. Settlers have arrived, looking for a fresh start. <laughs> All right, well, they're about to get some work over here, guys. They're about to get some work. Bordello finally can upgrade that. And let's get some people on it. My pleasure. There we, we can't go. train any more specialists here just now. Windmill, I think, will be my next one that I upgrade because I want to get those carrots. I don't know what my fascination with carrots is, but I want that done. I definitely want those people working. Um, I don't really have a lot of workers, though, so I may have to do another house. But I, I'm definitely doing the windmill first before I do that house. So why those guys are doing that, no Sir Gregory, you need some more experience, and we are going to go get you some. Now, these guys do respawn. I don't know if there's a way to kind of claim this area for yourself or destroy it or whatever the case may be, but they do respawn on their own, and uh, it's a nice steady source of experience if you let it. Time to die! <laughs> Dude is very cocky for considering how close he got to battle uh, death earlier. And when he dies... Guess what, guys? He dies. Like, he's just gone. You don't get him again. So I don't know if there's going to be, uh, you know, down the road, if they're going to, you know, change that. I was going to say fix it, but I don't think that's a mistake. I think they, they meant it to be that way. So maybe uh, maybe there's be a way to resurrect him down the road or something, because if he dies, I don't know what you do. Do you just send in, like, your regular dudes into the mine shaft to look for Tenny, uh, Kenny? Because if you do that, um, man, you, you're going to be in there for a while. And it's, it's not going to go well for you, so... I'm hoping that's not the case. 58 physical armor plus 6% shadow resistance. Wow. Tower shield of shadow resistance. Uncommon. Yeah, that is definitely uncommon. And uh, just one gold in there. But, you know, at, at that kind of price, I don't mind. So let's go ahead and kill this guy off. Actually, it won't use it, huh? Do you not have enough uh, power? There he goes. All right. What do you got? Two gold? Wow, they're cheap. Those are some cheap guys. Although, I do like the shield. Let's see... 58 versus 24. So, yeah, I'd say that as improvement. And that's only for Sir Gregory, so we'll go ahead and refine that. Get that out of the way. Wow. That is a cool shield. Look at that, guys. Let's see if we can turn the camera angle. Actually, let's see if we just get him to come down over here. That's cool. I like that. We're going to leave him there for a minute, though. Let's come back over here and get some of our stuff going on. We will upgrade this building. Come on. 
Can we, yep, ship a sifter, increase production of flour by one, and superior millstone, increase production of flour by one. So every every upgrade in this shop is for flour. None of them is for carrots. Why give you the ability to make carrots if you guys aren't going to, you know, let me, I don't know what my fascination with carrots is. I'm, I'm ridiculous. But still, you know, like I want to do carrots. I don't know why. My lord. Maybe it's because I can't. Like, when somebody says you can't do it, that's like when you want to do Today, it even more for some reason. But you die it's, it's not like they never said you couldn't do it. They just don't really give you anything to benefit you to do it, you know? So, I don't know. Maybe we'll see that in the future. I kind of hope you will, because I like carrots. I, you know, weird. Maybe they, maybe they put broccoli and stuff in there. <laughs> I'm asking for the moon. Uh, no, I just want I just want a couple upgrades for carrots. Just so that they, uh, they can keep up with them. They can never... I don't know how many farms I'm going to have to build. But I will do it. I will find a nice spot, and I'm going to build just farm after farm after farm if I have to. But I'm going to get a, a supply of, of carrots in there. Let's see. How is your life? Your life is full, but your magic is not. And you're We're probably going to need your magic over here. So let's let's give you a second. Area effect, shield bash. Let's do uh, power slam. Yes, like it. I like it a lot. Now remember, once you kill these spiders, you still have to kill the queen. Otherwise, uh, you know, you're just not going to really claim this area for yourself. And once you kill the queen, if you don't kill the spider den fast enough, the queen will respawn again. And you'll have to kill her all over again. So, yeah, definitely, uh, let's do decisive victory right here. Where's the queen? She's coming out. And there we go. Let's do uh, iron skin because you're pretty low. And remember, the, the queen does poison. So, you need to watch your life, even if you're thinking you're going to win that one and you know she's almost dead you could still die from it so we're, we're gonna have to run from this one she's she's just, just not going down fast enough As you come, man. all right so she's gonna wait right there and i'm gonna let my guy wait right here and you can see his life is just now starting to go up he hasn't gotten another level yet he's he's he should be close but not not quite there yet let's see 165 uh, iron we got plenty of money, so let's go ahead and buy some more of that. Let's go in there. Can we upgrade again? Nope. That's what we're waiting for on the other one. Let's uh, let's do a little bit more. And you can see we're doing maxed out on that one. There, there. We got a <laughs> you got a decent amount now. All right, we'll do uh, one house here, one house there. We'll wait for those people to come. We'll do one more house over here as well. There we go. All right, so we should have 10 people coming in now. So that's going to be uh, four for this building right here and four for this building right here. And maybe a couple in the bakery, although look at how much bread we have. That is that is probably more Our bread than we need. New settlers. So I don't think we really need to worry about that. Let's just let's just put them over here. This building already supports the maximum number of specialists. All right, all right. We got it already. Where's my dude? How you doing? You're full life. Okay. So let you get back over here. Onward. See if you can kill the queen this time, guy. Forward. Let's do, uh, yeah. Two victory. Extra life. Come on, get in there. Get in there. Better to do it. Oh, there's two spider queens. New villagers have arrived. No, no, no. There's just a spider queen and the spider den. Okay. I was going to say, man, they, they spawn fast. All right, let's do shield bash. We'll do uh, power slam. It's going to use a little bit more power for us, but, uh, you know, it's a right. decisive victory. Definitely won't kill them, but... You can use that multiple times in a fight, and even if it doesn't kill him, it does 120% physical damage. So that's really, really nice. Of course, it is really nice if you, you can use it and uh, kill him off that way. Let's do Shield Bash. Wow, this guy has a lot of hit points. A lot. He's the only level one. Settlers Why is it taking so long to kill this guy? Do it. Do it. Yes. Fine. Yes. You got it. You got it. Yeah, we'll go back and, and check those, those settlers out. I don't like leaving them there for too long. There's eight of them sitting around doing nothing when they could be... Uh, you know, contributing to the overall happiness of our town here. Spider Silk, Venom Sack. Uh, I'm going to leave you alone for a second. Hopefully, I will not rue that. I'll have to look up in the left-hand corner and make sure we're not going to lose him. No vacancies at this no time. No vacancies. Okay, so you are good. Eight there. Four here. Let's do one here. Um, We'll do two here. And just get that kind of going again. Meat pies really can't keep up because they're just not producing the meat. Let's let's look at that to make sure. Yeah, there's absolutely no meat in there except for the the 17, 18 slices they got. That's that's not good enough. 
Even if they um, got a couple more workers in there, they might be able to make it a little faster. Ah, there's another one. Well, he's definitely going to get a level here pretty soon with this much killing. Ooh, what is this? What is over here? This is interesting. I don't think we've ever come this far, so we'll definitely have to check this out. What's up here? Anything? Mm, there is the edge of the map, but I don't see anything else. We're going to be looking around, though. We'll definitely be going to be looking around here. How's my... Oh, we got some more iron, so let's get some more guys in here. Upgrade one more of our houses. Come on. Yes, get some more workers. Get some more mouths to feed, guys. Um, 13 on the salmon steak. Okay, so I'm just making sure we're not going down after I said that I was joking around, but then I was like, no, we actually are getting more mouths to feed, and uh, we might not like that. Okay, so you killed that off, didn't you? Yep. All right. Not getting very much loot. Hey, I played uh, an earlier version before they, the new patch came out, and you got a lot of loot from these you monsters. I think they, they kind of lowered that down. I think it said in the option, or not in the option, in the updates, the reason you got a lot of loot off of the monsters was because they hadn't integrated in the uh, ability to make armor yet. And because you couldn't make armor, they were kind of giving you the... Uh, the ability to experiment with that Settlers equipment in another way by just stuff. giving it to you. So now that you can actually make stuff, I think they've kind of taken that or dialed it down a little bit and you're just not going to get it nearly as much because, you know, they want you to actually make it yourself instead of just getting it. All right, let's 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 go back up here. We're going to stop right there, go back and send our guys to work. Where are you at? Hmm... Did, did that get upgraded? Was there anything left in here? Superior milestone, production of flour. Yet again, more flour? More flour, I guess, is, is the way to go, guys. More flour. All right. 73, 60, 100. And that's valid. Okay, that's so maybe we don't have enough farms now that we have all these people. But just barely. What about you? Keen taste. So you're upgraded. You're upgraded. Uh... I don't know where the extra people should go. I got six people. I guess I can put them in bakery. Okay. Whoa, we got. Oh, yeah, we can put them down here. Because right we do got the cotton fields. If you look at it, the cotton fields are 100% on two of them. So definitely go with that. Although, how much cotton do we have? We have no cotton. But we have 3,405 of the uh, cotton bolts. Or bolts of cotton, I should say. <laughs> waiting to be turned into clothing at our tailor's emporium. So if anything, this should be the the place we upgrade in, instead of the other one so that they can actually keep up with just how much. Yeah, 3,400, and they got all of this in 27. Okay, so yeah, we may need to put down another storage yard somewhere as well so that we can carry more, more stuff before we run out. I don't know where we need it, though. Maybe a woodcutter's lodge, I'm thinking. Yeah, woodcutter lodge somewhere out here in this region wouldn't be too bad. So let's let's build one actually out here. Let's bring this guy Teasing down the here. And these uh these spider dens, man, they used to spawn like crazy guys. I, I kid you not. It was very difficult to keep up with them. I, I could not kill them fast enough. There we go. Let's do area effect. Actually we'll do iron skin. And then we'll do a power slam. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Yes. Wow, one hit. That is more like it. Okay, bring out the spider queen. We want her. Not one. Kill her. Kill her. Now, if you had more than one person here, you could have a couple of them on the spider queen and a couple of them on the other, you know, um, you know, den to try to kill it off before the new spider queen spawned. Because we're just doing it with him, we don't really have that option. But and definitely something you can try. Yeah, that does so much freaking damage. It's crazy. Come on. Yes. All right. Do iron skin. That's going to low us on our power, but we should be good. I am going to sit here and watch to make sure. He is uh, He's about half on my life, on, on Sir Gregory, and the spider's down to about two bubbles, which mm, not exactly where I would like the spider to be. Let's go with... Uh, the, the, yeah, that's it. Whew. Now, I think that saved my life. I don't think I'd be able to kill it otherwise. So while he's doing that, I'm going to watch his life, of course. But we're going to come back over here. We've got one worker. we got some more some more iron. So let's go ahead and upgrade this. <laughs> and I may end up just buying some more iron. Like It seems like that's the fastest method 
with how much cash that I have, that's going to take a while. That's going to take a long while. All right, let's still buy some more iron, guys. Let's see how much we're going to buy. We can upgrade that, too. We might get enough to upgrade it just to uh, see what happens. All right, how much is that going to give me? Our a lot. Has attracted new settlers. All right, so that's fully upgraded. And <laughs> still taking my money. 7,600. Okay, so I'm down to 7,600. And I think it was at, what, 13,000? Or 13... Yeah, I think it was at, like, 13,000, so... New settlers have arrived. Decent chunk of change right there, guys. Che decent chunk of change. Upgrade. Yep, that's going to be the last upgrade for that house. This is going to be the last house that I can upgrade unless I build another one. What about... Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade this hunting lodge. Wow, look how much iron I have, guys. That is nuts. We're going to go ahead and upgrade all of our buildings really quickly. And as we do so, we're going to run out of wood. So now we are out of wood. All right, we'll give them a chance to catch up. New villagers. Ready yeah. to serve. New villagers, you need to come over here and build a, f a place to chop down some trees. Right out here somewhere, right where all the trees are at. A nice, decent amount where it's not safe at all. And there's another thing of spiders out here. Wow. How many spider dens are there? I don't even see a spider den out here. These are just regular spiders just kind of chilling out here. Time to die. Free experience for this guy. Looking for a fresh start. Power slam. Marauders <laughs> are ransacking our village. Where? Where are they ransacking our village? This isn't our village. This is not our village. This is this is outside of our village where my guy is completely, you know, on his own and, and doing perfectly fine with uh, several spider queens apparently for some reason. Like why why does he have this many spider queens? I do not know. He's not going to be able to beat them all, so let's go ahead and uh, run away for a second. Let him recharge some of his power as well as his life. Why these things just kind of uh, do a little bit of damage to him. And yeah, we'll get that. New I, settlers have arrived. I think what it is is they keep coming over here to set up a, a base, and these towers just keep wrecking them from a distance, and they just keep spawning more and more of these spider queens until there's there's just like five, six of them over here. Orders all right. Received. We're going to go back in again. Give it a, just a tiny bit more. Get all the way back up to full life. There's still two of them there. Although, they should be pretty hurt by now. Alright, do it, guys. Do it. Do it. Get in there. Alright, power slam. Or shield bash, I should say. Then we're going to do a power slam. Get a little bit of life on both of them. No, it only actually hit one of them. Arm yourself. This guy, we can use our decisive victory. Won't kill him. But look at how much life we took off of him, guys. That is worth it in its own right. Oh, man. Come on, level this guy up already. He has to be close, right? There we go, finally. Whew, it only took long enough. All right, let's do some strength on this guy. He, he definitely needs to hit harder. Otherwise, he's going to be here all day trying to do these things. All right. Uh, I guess let's go ahead and build a woodcutter's lodge out here. Let's do it right over here somewhere if we can. Will it not let us? No, it's not flat right here. It is flat right here, though. Right where it's not right safe to be, you. apparently. <laughs> so we have no choice. We either uh, kill this thing or we uh, we lose some people. So we are going to kill this thing. <laughs> okay. Well, apparently Ooh, our towers some. our towers had... Uh, oh. Something's not right. You men wait here in case more of Kenny's lackeys show up and outflink me. I'll head in and open a can of whoop ass on these rascals. Although someone seems to have beaten me to it. All right, so that is uh, what he says when you get close to that entrance. Apparently, one of our workers got close to it and uh, you know kind of started that that little transition there of uh, or that little dialogue. But that's all right. I mean, it's building it's, completed. Let's let's get this going, guys. Let's get some people in here. Okay. All right. The only way someone is getting in there <laughs> is if someone dies, is fired, or we make it bigger. Okay, well, we'll we make it bigger then. We can't train any more specialists here just now. That's right. That's exactly right, guys. I'm so rich, Our I'll just make it bigger. need to saw more planks before we can do that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I can't upgrade the woodcutter without more wood. Be right there, darling. That, that's like a little bit of irony right there for you guys. There we go. Now it's upgraded. We'll put some more people in here. Get this going as fast oh, as way. possible. How much... How much... Uh, firewood do we got we got plenty of firewood actually it's going down though you can see it's going down but it's going back up as well so 
Hmm. I have more workers. No vacancies at this time. Okay, so you're good. This building already supports the maximum number of Ready for battle! The only way someone is getting in there is if someone dies, is fired, or we make it bigger. Nothing to see. We can't train oh, any man. more specialists. I, I, I wish there was a way... You know, this kind of reminds me of, like, Warcraft, if you guys ever played that back in the day. It's a game by Blizzard. When you clicked on a peon, he used to be like, uh, my lord? Or, like, what? You know, kind of thing where he's like, what do you want me to do? If you kept clicking on him, though, and I mean, you had to click him like 80, 90, 100 times, he'd finally say something different, which is kind of funny because they didn't have a lot of programming back then, and so they didn't have a lot of space to make that so he could say something different. And so they, the fact that they took the time and the space to do so was really cool. And he'd be like, stop clicking on me. That's kind of like what this guy kind of reminds me of. When you click it a million times, he doesn't stop. He doesn't get that the fact that you may have clicked it one too many times and be like, oh, okay, uh, you know, maybe I'll only say it once or twice and then I won't say it anymore for like the 80 clicks that you used. He just keeps going. And so it's kind of like funny in its own right where he's like, you know, just stop clicking on me. Otherwise, you're going to have to listen to me for the next like half an hour because you clicked that button that many times. And so you got to be a little careful with it. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but I, it definitely is kind of interesting at the oh, very Lord. least. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, give it to him on a good thing, and uh, I'll let you guys decide for yourself. But I think it's interesting. Wow, this this area looks really, you know, forbo foreboding and uh, kind of murky until we came over here. Now it actually looks quite beautiful. So explore the map, guys. There's there's a lot of beauty to this area. Tally -ho. Let's get over here. I did not forget about that tree over there. We saw. I just kind of got distracted by needing more wood so we could upgrade more of our buildings. So, you know, it's just one of those things all over again that I'm just too too easily amused, too easily distracted by things. Let's go ahead and upgrade our storage. It's going to use a little bit of wood, isn't it? Yep. Dang it. Right as I'm coming over here to upgrade more stuff. Okay, Hunter's Lodge definitely needs to be upgraded. Come on, 10 more wood. There we go. Can we upgrade any more? Yeah. Range finding, production of raw meat by one, and animal calls increase product. Yeah, okay, so we're going to do all of that. Yes, we are. All right, anything on these? Because we did upgrade some of them, right? The windmill? No, that wasn't it. What did we upgrade? We were upgrading, like, everything there for a minute. Ah, uh, there we go. Master stones cutters. Stone blocks by five. Okay, we'll take that. Uh, Woodcutter, stonehouse, blacksmith. Our town is under attack. Where? Where is our town under attack? By what? I don't. I don't see anything down here. Is it uh, because he's sick? It might be because he's sick. Although I don't think it is. Is there something down here? No. That was. Uh, that was kind of weird. Kind of had me going there for a second that uh, maybe I wasn't paying attention to something important. Let's go ahead and upgrade this building. Feel I feel kind of self-conscious about it now. Poisons. Unlock poison crafting recipes not implemented yet. Definitely going to do it, though. All right, you guys are good. Let's, let's go back up to the top. What is down here? It's, it's attacking something. Oh, it's the spiders. Okay, so there are some spiders down here. Oh, there it is. Okay, so they were killing one. I don't know where these spiders are coming from. Let's go to our Sir Gregory. What are you doing, Sir Gregory? I stand ready. Just hanging out? Just chilling? Was there a spider den over here? Did you kill it all by yourself without me having to be here? That would be fantastic. It would be nice if you got a level out of it, too. Didn't happen, though, did it? No, it sure didn't. You are fine over here. So let's see. Where are we going to go? We're going to come down here right where we were. We're going to take out this other spider's den, and we're going to come over here and check out this, because that looks really interesting. I don't think it's going to take too long to get over there, either. Now, like I said, we're, we're doing all this before we go into Kenny's. We will, of course, go to Kenny's, and then the next few episodes after that will probably happen very quickly, where we go and explore all of the cool stuff that this map has to offer as far as quests go, but we're very close to having our city completely maxed out. Still haven't gotten that uh, the carrot stuff to go. So, yeah, I am obsessed. I am obsessed with that stuff, but we will we will do it. We are going to get that to happen. Let's do this. Can we upgrade? No, you can't upgrade any more on those things. Those things are such a rip-off. Come on, give me some more upgrades. I like upgrades, guys. I like them. 
Let's see, we got four people just sitting still, so let's right, come down so here. This person will leave you without any peasants. How much potions? Oh, look at that. Lesser potions. We got 1,300 of them. I think we have enough of that. I think we have plenty of that. Before we end the episode, <laughs> we are going to come down here and kill one more set of spiders. And then uh, I guess I'll have to save the teaser for I'll the really next episode over attack. here because we just don't have enough time to do it. Didn't plan it that way, guys. Uh, you know, honest, I wasn't trying to uh, make you guys have to come back for another episode. I don't normally do that. But, uh, yeah, I don't want to make this too long. We're already at 35 minutes on the on the time right there, and I try to keep them at about 30 minutes. So let's, uh, let's back Double it up, time. actually. Let's back it up, let my life go up a little bit. Do... Uh, do defense right there. I guess we're, we're going to attack him a little early. We'll go with uh, Shield Bash to stun him. Get a little bit of extra, you know, damage in. And do my uh, Decisive Victory a little early. But, you know, to be honest, if you do that early, it comes back. And then you're able to do it again as long as you have power. Which we, we're not going to have power because I pretty much used all the stuff I have. But we may. I mean, it's come, our power is coming back pretty quick, too. Our health is going down pretty quick. But, uh, come on, you can do it. Let me use it a little bit more, a little bit more. I need 70. How much do I have? There we go. You can kill him. Yes. Perfect. Plus 30 on the gold right there. So you did get a little bit of gold for finishing that off. But guys, I want to thank you all again for watching. If you do enjoy these videos, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. Definitely helps grow the channel, and I greatly appreciate it. But more than that, guys, if you want to uh, see more games like this in the future, definitely go online. Let the developers know on Steam if you're on there, guys. Hit that thumbs up button and write a little review. It doesn't have to be complicated. It doesn't have to be a long review. Even just a short and sweet one to say, hey, I like the way this game looks. Can't wait to play it myself. Let's other people know about it and uh, we'll help those game companies out that you yourself would like to see uh, you know, prosper and, and make more games that you love and, and want to play more in the future. And as always, guys, I'm AC Gamer, and I'll definitely catch you all next time.